Hello everyone. Good afternoon, dear students. How are you doing this afternoon? I hope you guys are doing okay. And uh, today we are going to be talking about a uh, preposition. So, what is preposition? Preposition. It is the location of the place or an object of a place. Again, preposition. It is the location of a place or an object or something. For example, we can have a, we can say, where is the ball? The ball is on the box. Where is the cat? The cat is under the table. That is just a few examples. Now, B, we are going to move to types of so before we continue that was just an introduction so now we should go to writing today today is monday today is monday the today is monday the 11th right this morning the 11th January 2021 English language Preposition. So, before we move into the lesson, we need to know what preposition is all about. In our definition, we are going to give some key examples that we are going to follow. Definition. Preposition is a location location of a place. Position of 
place. So definition. Preposition is a location of a place or an object or something in bracket. I hope you understand me, dear students. I know preposition is very easy to understand. You just need to know the location of places. It could be a school, a garden, it could be a bus station, it could be a market, it could be the park. That is location. Then object. Object could be a ball, a card, a text, a pen, anything. Or when we put something, it could be anything as as in uh, as in chair, table, shoes, box, right? So that is it. So that is the definition for you, for your level of understanding. So preposition is a location of a place or an object or something. Something could be anything. So now we are going to move to vocabulary of preposition or different types of preposition. Now B, A was definition. B, B we talked about. Let's go to book. B, we are going to be talking about vocabulary of position. Now we talk about vocabulary. Vocabulary of Position. Position. We draw our line. Now we are now on vocabulary. Vocabulary of position. Now we are going to bring out some few. For you to understand how it works and I'm also going to do a demonstration for you to understand better how we use position or preposition of place or object all right so now we are going to go to the first one the first one we are going to take in as in in I and in okay in small letter to on 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 o n on three our board is small okay the projector is small we go to three three we're going to talk of under 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 you N D E R under okay under U N D E R next preposition we're going to take behind 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 in front behind in front, behind, behind, B, E, H, I, N, D, behind, behind, next, we're going to take in front, in front, in front, we drew it behind, now, in front, in front of, in front of, it's up to you, you can say in front of, in front of or in front. Let's take the fifth one. The fifth one. In front of. In front of. Hope you can see. 
in front of in front of the seed one the seed one we are going to be talking about uh, between between for example we can say this is an orange this is a mango and where is the teacher's head the teacher's head is between an orange and the mango this is between between b e t w w n e w n w e n sorry okay so between between I guess you can see. Or oh, let me shape the E very well. Between. That is between. We have already six. We will take ten because of time constraint. Because of time, we're going to take ten today. So between, we have our uh, inside inside the pen is inside his pocket inside inside outside inside outside in all right now we move to number seven number seven we have uh, inside inside i n s i d e inside inside for example but look at this inside inside okay and if we have uh, we have beside beside okay take beside b e s i d e beside 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 okay and the ninth Ninth, we have around, around, around. A R O N U N D. Around, around, around. And the last ten, we have up, 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 up. U. B. All right. So uh, those are examples of preposition. Now I am going to demonstrate to you very fast, so you can uh, you can understand better. Now we are going to move to the practical. This is a box, and we have different varieties of fruits. Okay. The first one we are going to use in. In, in. So the box. You open the box. Apple. Example. Apple. The apple is in the box. The apple is in the box. That is number one. Number two. On, on. We close the box. The mango. The mango is on the box. The mango is on the box. And go very fast. Number three, down. Down. Okay, let's use banana. The banana. Okay, that's down. Down. Pick it up. Down. Under. Okay, so under. The banana is under the box. Under the box. Thank you very much. Let's go very fast. Next, we have four behind the ball. The ball is behind the box. Behind. Okay. Next, we have in front. In front, the orange. Orange. The orange is in front of the box. 
Next, we have between. Okay, now we have we have box, banana, and bar. Where is the box? Where is the box? The box is between the ball and the banana. This is the box. This is the box. Banana ball. Thank you. Next is inside. Inside. The banana is inside the box. Next we have beside. Okay. Peanut. Peanut. Beside. Beside. The peanuts are beside the box. The peanuts are beside the box. Thank you. Next we have we have a banana beside. Beside beside the box. And the ball. Around. The ball is spinning around the box. The ball is spinning around the box. The last one is up. The mango is up the tree. Like up. Up. Okay. So I uh, thank you very much for these uh, examples. Now before we leave, we have a worksheet. Our worksheet is this. Fill in the blanks with the appropriate preposition. Fill in the blanks with the appropriate preposition. Okay? Number one example. The ball is dash the box. Number two. The ball is dash the box. Number three. The ball is dash the box. Number four. The ball is dash the boxes. Number five. The ball is dash the box. Thank you very much and hope to see you again next time. Bye-bye.